Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I have watched the first two episodes of the Lord of the Rings: Rings of Power television show. So far, not bad. First off, Amazon should take off the Lord of the Rings from the title because it does a disservice to J.R.R. Tolkien's works. With that said, I do not think the first two episodes were bad. But actually fine, not great, but fine. However, I watched them as if they were a separate story happening on a separate planet than from J.R.R. Tolkien's Middle Earth world. If you play Dungeons and Dragons, I view this show as being told by a dungeon master who was inspired by J.R.R. Tolkien's work and world. Of Middle Earth, but it definitely is not J.R.R. Tolkien's world. So basically, this show is an expensive fan fiction. I watched this show for entertainment purposes and not for canon violations with Tolkien's works. For canon violations, other YouTubers do a much better job of this than I can. Anyway, like I said. I had to watch this show as a separate world slash entity from Tolkien's works in order to enjoy it, which I did, and hence was able to enjoy it. There are a few things that bothered me about the show, but the one thing that stuck out to me is the soldiers that were under Galadriel's command. They were all male. It should have been more mixed, both in terms of gender and in skin color. So this is an instance of the show being sexist and dot dot dot. However, I can see problems with the show in the future if it tries to tie itself with Tolkien's original works. For instance, I suspect that Starman. Will turn out to be a young Gandalf, which can ruin the show for me. After all, there is a limit to how much I can pretend that the names just coincidentally match the names of J.R.R. Tolkien's characters. As I stated, so far I think the show is fine, but I can see how it can be derailed very fast. And become a shit show. If you have made it this far into this video, then I thank you for watching this long. I will now state my further honest opinions, which may be controversial to Tolkien fans. First, let me state that I am more of a fan of Robert E. Howard and Edgar Rice Burroughs stories. Than I am of J.R.R. Tolkien, not because the latter authors were more lowbrow, but because Tolkien's Lord of the Rings trilogy was more of a sausage fest, which is why I love Peter Jackson's adaptation of the Lord of the Rings more than the books. It added more female elements into the story. I love watching drama between male and female characters and relationships because I understand the dynamics between men and women, but only as long as the drama keeps it realistic, which nowadays I am afraid to say is no longer the case. Hmm. Maybe I should do a separate video on how to pick up women, and no. It would not be cheesy or misogynistic as most infamous pickup artists would be. Basically, it would be about courage and exhibiting that courage. Anyway, back to the topic at hand. The first two episodes of Rings of Power were not bad as long as you think of it separate from J.R.R. Tolkien's world happening. On another planet, as a J.R.R. Tolkien fan, well, I think other YouTubers will do a better job at dissecting the show. 
Was watching the first two episodes a waste of time? My answer is no. Am I hooked at watching future episodes? My answer again is no. Unless, for some reason, this video goes viral, then I will force myself to watch and review future episodes. So, what do you think of The Rings of Power? Let us discuss in the comments below. Thank you for watching. Hope you found this video informative and entertaining. Till next time, cheers and have a good day.